Today I'm gonna be showing you the best way to get gold in build a boat for a treasure which is afk farming and all the tools we will need in this video are the scale and screwdriver tool and also the binding tool and less than 1000 blocks of any sort. This afk farm makes 15,000 golds an hour and is one of the cheapest you can make. Don't forget to like and subscribe and let's start with the tutorial. Ok guys so the first step is to place 4 trusses after this dark green area. Get yourself 14 pistons and make sure anchor block is off, yes 14. Then place yourself a switch and activate them all. Put any type of block over here, actually 3 of them and scale the last one to the start of the building area. And if you don't have that much blocks you can scale it down if you want. Now go ahead and uh, place another block over here and uh, place your scale on 40. Scale it one time up and three times to the side, just like that. Now come over here and uh, place a block in the middle, just like this. And, and then place yourself a glue block, just like that. And a portal on top of it. Scale this block if you want, but make sure that it, do it doesn't touch the portal. And you can check that by uh, clicking on the screwdriver tool and as you guys can see, it does not touch it. And yeah, just scale it up and cover the portal with it. This is optional, but it provides more safety, you can say. So yes. So come over here, place your rotation on 15 and rotate it 5, five times. Scale it to the other side of the spawn capture and scale it up. Now make sure it doesn't hit the portal, so what we're gonna do is just scale it out and to make sure it doesn't hit, yeah, it's, it's perfect. So now we, when, once we do that, it's perfect. We're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Rotate it one time only. Now you can save and then place yourself a rod and then any type of block on it. Make it 40 studs tall, something like this. It shouldn't be that... Uh, Perfect, but uh, yeah, 40 studs makes sense. And after that, place yourself a butter block like this and another one right next to it and make sure it's in the middle. And you can check that with your scaling tool. As you guys can see, this dot is, uh, is within the glue block over here. So yeah, we're gonna do the same thing to the front over here. And now you're gonna place a portal on top of each one. Now color this portal over here white. And then place yourself a jet turbine. Any jet turbine w would work, but this is the best because it's, it's the slowest. And then place yourself a pilot seat. Now, if you have the binding tool, uh, just unbind these glue blocks from this switch. That's, uh, that's very important to do. And yeah, that's all you have to do. Come over here and make sure you're exactly in front of the white team flag just like this i think this is perfect and then place yourself a rod just like this and then place any type of block you want i'm gonna use the metal block uh, scale it down so it can be easier and then put your scale on, on 605.25 and click on the scaling tool and just um, move your camera down and put your and scale out and you'll automatically scale it as you guys can see it ne you need some patience with it but uh, yeah it's uh, that's all you have to do then place yourself a seat and make sure um, it looks exactly like this not like this it should be like this just like that save and let's start duping so the first step you have to do is placing the firework if you if you if you have the cake you can use it but the firework is obtainable by the code chill real 709 was here you can claim this code and get the firework block then place it exactly like this so it's so it connects to your body and connects to the um to the metal block over here and then yeah delete delete the seed delete the rod and as you guys can see we can move with it now ma put match rotation on and place any type of jet you want i'm gonna use the purple jets because it's faster you can of course use any type of flying glitch to get to the waterfalls but i think this is the easiest so just jump and activate it once you reach the waterfall just go ahead and reload your uh, afk farm and go back to the plot Let's once you're back, you're gonna place another jet just facing up and 
clicking on it and once you reach the top you can uh, you can just walk and delete it place another seat at the top make sure it looks like this sit on it flex all anchor delete the firework delete this save and reload and i have duped once so i'm just gonna put one in the chat so i don't forget i'm gonna do it three more times now okay guys once you have duped it four times what you're gonna go ahead and do is just place yourself a seat a firework and two jet turbines on top of it you can use any type of jet turbine so yeah you're just gonna jump and make sure they're unanchored yeah, just like this and then click on one of them and if one of the jets stop working just activate the second one and that happens if you're using the winter or the normal jet turbine so yeah I've, I've reached the top so i'm just gonna go ahead and anchor this i was a bit too late so i'm just gonna go ahead and activate it again once i reach the top i'm just gonna go ahead and anchor all of this stuff just like that and once you're here put anchor block on place yourself a block and put your scale on 15 scale it down one time and then place yourself a portal and make sure to color it white save everything and reload and we are actually done with the afk farm itself now we have to start uh setting it up so the first step to do is just uh sit in here delete the rod and yeah just unanchor everything click on the jet turbine and select this and the jet turbine with your screwdriver tool by clicking shift in your uh, if you're on pc so once you've reached the second stage what you're gonna do is put the jet speed on on 10 just like this and anchor the plot the base thing and the jet now you can delete the jet and then select these and anchor them then delete the glue blocks now you can just um, delete your pilot seat and go back to your plot once you're back what you're gonna do is just click the switch and yeah just unanchor everything oh, there was a mistake wait so yeah the glue block that we put o over here uh, actually actually get activated when we I don't know when but maybe when, the, when we click the switch and yeah if that ever happens to you just load everything and uh, the thing that you place in the stages will not get deleted because it's uh, past the waterfalls and then just check if it's uh, binded to anything and as you guys can see it's binded to this and now just save everything that's our mistake only now you can delete this because we have already put one in the stages click on the switch and make sure everything is unanchored okay guys so before you click the switch click on these th first three pistons and then click on the switch and yeah as you guys can see now it's perfect covering the whole spawn capture and now um place yourself any type of rod turn anchor block off place yourself a normal jet turbine and a block at uh, the end of it so now click this with their screwdriver tool and put the jet speed on 25 delete the rod and then click this and you're going to anchor it with your screwdriver tool just like this delete the jet scale this and make sure to not place any blocks on it just scale it so it comes over here as you guys can see now it's a conveyor as you guys can see we're not actually in the middle so what we're gonna do is place another seat facing down in front of the flag white team flag just come over here place yourself a firework make sure it touches you and the middle delete the seat delete this select all of these with your screwdriver and unanchor sit in this seat select all of this make sure to not select all because that will break the spawn capture just select all of these and then anchor reset your character and start grinding 